Hello to everyone watching this footage. It's Leviathan here again. And to start things off, I have to be honest with, honest with you guys. Um, I'm feeling gradually paranoid because I was supposed to make this video three days from now, but I just figured I should just do it before I get any more stressed and such. And also, just so you know, three days from now is the birthday of one of my brothers, Anders. You know, just as a something to consider at all, you know. For this particular video, I'm going to introduce three different characters. And I hope you guys would appreciate them. The first one that I'm going to introduce, I hope you guys wouldn't be offended in any incarnation through uh, different circumstances, you know. I just hope you would put it to consideration, you know. Here it is. Ebony Galvins. Real name, none. Height, 6 feet 1 and a half inches. Weight, 144 pounds. Status, hero and intergalactic supermodel. Base, two Earths and mobile. Intelligence, three and a half brains. Behavior, loving and willful. She always enjoys being beautiful. Lethality, only when threatened or during a fight. Weaknesses, she has no healing factor, and rejection. Powers. She possesses three uh, pictorials, along with martial arts and uncanny beauty. She's also a good judge of character. Eyes, sky blue. Hair, deep green and flowing. Origin. Since her childhood, Ebony Galvins had always wanted to be an intergalactic supermodel, though she did not look the part. One day, Ebony was chosen by the legendary Blue Man Clan in order for her to become perfect for the job, like she always wanted. However, the machine happened to experience an unintended power surge, and Ebony ended up with both astonishing beauty and the unintended oddity of having three pectorals rather than two. No hard feelings. Surprisingly, Ebony didn't mind, and after helping Madame Shear with a fight against a six-legged roundhouse, she would spend her time helping other heroes with most problems. Costume, she simply wears nothing official, so nothing in particular. She just wears whatever she feels like wearing. Teams, solitary, or with other heroes. Original inspiration, Eccentrica Galumbits. I hope you don't mind, just for a heads up. The next character is this one. Faceless. Real name, Laura Eccles. Height, 5 feet 11. Weight, 157 pounds. Status, hero and leader of the Universal Misfits. Base, New York City, mobile. Intelligence, 3.5 brains. Behavior, sneaky, confident, and mysterious. She'll always think twice about exposing any intended secret. Lethality. Highly lethal to most opponents. Weaknesses. She has no healing factor. Powers. She literally has no face. She could do martial arts, has high agility, is a good tracker, and can reason with most targets. She could also go without the need for food, drink, sleep, or oxygen. Eyes. None. Hair. Tannish blonde and wavy. Origin. There is once a married couple known as the Eccles who made the mistake of doubting that Wrath was ever a concern. Outraged of these doubts, the tyrannical Wrath condemned them into having a daughter without a face, whom they named Laura. After a time of hiding her unintended secret, Laura decided to make a living by becoming an agent and taught herself how to fight. Eventually, she successfully kept the spiritual dead and manipulative impersonator from killing the president by beating them silly, despite their attributes. Since then, the president marked Laura as a hero to the people. Using a special black mask to hide her blank spot, Faceless now leads her own team of heroes, the Universal Misfits, in order to protect the innocence of the globe from most forms of crime and chaos. Costume she simply wears a black leather jumpsuit. Teams, 
Solitary leads to Universal Misfits and other heroes. Original inspiration, DC's The Question. This is one more character. Just, you know, just so you know. Just, I hope you're going along with me properly. Gab. Real name, Gabigail Buxom. Height, 6 foot 3. Weight, 146 pounds. Status, human and secretary of lovely Liz. Base, default Earth mobile. Intelligence, 3.5 brains. Behavior, loving, willful, and cheerful. She enjoys helping her boss with any objective. Lethality, only when threatened or during a fight. Weaknesses, she has no healing factor. Powers, she has martial arts skills, high willpower, and uncanny reasoning skills. Eyes, deep green. Hair, bright blonde and flowing. Origin. Ever since she was four, Gabigail Buxon wanted to be a politician. By adulthood, Gab was promoted by office to become the secretary of the dedicated Lovely Liz, who was the successor of the U.S. president that I mentioned earlier. At one point, Gab was captured by the Nazi commander Valkyrie and placed for ransom, but luckily, Lovely Liz arrived and saved her before anything got worse. Since then, Gabbett Gale would do all that's necessary to protect her country along with help from her boss. Well, with help from her boss, you know? Costume. She dresses in former formal political clothes. Teams. Solitary with Lovely Liz and other heroes. Original inspiration. Marvel's Millie the Model. Well, I hope you guys have an appreciation, or at least had, an appreciation for those three characters I've introduced. And I, and, um, I just hope you guys are having a fine, um, 2022 thus far. Um, if you guys want, you could like, subscribe, and comment down below. It's your choice. And if you have any more questions and concerns and such, just ask them if you want. It's all on you. I just hope this is the right reality on behalf of my creations. I know that there's a reality where my creations truly succeed that much. I just hope that this reality would be no different in terms of that. So I hope you guys have a fine time so far and enjoy the rest of your um, January and such. And until next time, end transmission.